Well, in today's video, I want to talk about Rick Wiles and True News. What do you think about Rick Wiles and True News? You won't find him on YouTube. He was banned from YouTube in 2020. But let's talk about him. Well, I haven't done one of these drive along and make a video in a long time, but today is a beautiful July day and I'm driving along and what's on my mind that I want to talk to you guys about is Rick Wiles and True News. Well, if you've not heard of Rick Wiles or True News, he's a broadcaster. And sit back and listen, and I'm going to tell you what I know about True News, and then I want you to comment down below and let me know what you know about True News, or let me know if you have even heard of True News. So stay tuned. Rick Wiles is 68 years old and lives in Vero Beach, Florida. He's the founder of True News. Well, you won't be able to find True News on YouTube. As I stated earlier, I believe Rick was banned from YouTube in 2020. I think it was a permanent ban from YouTube. So I don't even know if you'll get to see this video. But I find True News and Rick Wiles very interesting. I'm not sure how I found Rick Wiles, but I know it was during the Trump Hillary Clinton presidential election. During that election, I somehow ran across one of his broadcasts. I don't remember if it was a podcast or on YouTube or exactly where it was, but I thought he was such an interesting broadcaster. He certainly has a gift for broadcasting. Whether Rick is discussing economic news, international news, cryptocurrency, he makes it entertaining. He's really, really got a gift. Now, I have to admit, some of his stories are really out there. Rick Wiles got started in broadcasting in 1980 when he went to work for CNN and ESPN. In 1984, he went to work for the Christian Broadcast Network, CBN. And in 1995, Rick was hired as the marketing director of TBN. According to Rick, in 1998, he received a dramatic call from God to go into full-time ministry. In September of that year, Rick resigned from TBN. He began his ministry in the Fort Worth area and traveled around the United States, warning audiences about moral decline in the USA and about economic collapse and war on American soil. He was seen on many television and radio programs in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. One radio station suggested that he start his own radio program, and Rick did just that. His first broadcast was May 24th of 1999. The original name was America's Hope. The message was simple. Jesus Christ is America's only hope. Rick's come a long way since that first broadcast. True News has grown. In 2004, Rick changed the name to True News. Well, it's now become a weekday, hour-long broadcast. And it's not just Rick. He's had many co-hosts over the years. People like Edward Zoll, Doc Burkhart, and Kerry Kinsley, to name a few. Now, Edward Zoll is no longer with True News. Edward was fired abruptly after the My Pillow CEO Mike Lindell symposium. Edward was representing True News at that symposium and something went on and Edward was fired. Well, Edward has moved on. He now has a podcast called Crosstalk News. Another co-anchor, Zach Drew, came and went pretty quickly, and in my opinion, also left abruptly. Zach Drew got his start on The Jim Baker Show. After leaving True News, Zach has started his own show called The Zach Drew Show. If you Google Rick Wiles, you would read that he's a far-right American conspiracy theorist. <laughs> they would say he's a religious extremist. And they'd also mention that he was a pastor of Flowing Stream Church. Well, love him or hate him, Rick Wiles is a very good broadcaster. If you ever see True News, I think you'll be impressed with how well he can tell a story. When he tells you the news, it's interesting and it definitely holds your attention. It's an entertaining program. 
So let me know down below in the comments. What do you think about True News and Rick Wiles? Do you think Rick Wiles is really on to something when he analyzes current events? Or do you think he's a nut? <laughs> Comment down below and let me know. Until next time, bye.